Hey guys, it's me, Laura Melendez from Vintage Thrifted Treasures, and I'm going to do a super quick video because I don't have a lot of time. And the last video I did was like two weeks ago, maybe. So um, I have a little bit of time before I go to bed tonight, which I think today is what, Tuesday, maybe? Um, I bought this box, gosh, almost, almost a year ago. It was in the beginning of 2020. And this whole entire thing is filled with, I guess, Christmas ornaments. So I bought the whole entire box for $5, $4.99. And I have yet to open anything in here. So we're going to unbox it together. I've been waiting almost, gosh, more than half a year to see what's in this thing. So that's what today's video is going to be about so if you are interested to see what is in this giant box here then stay tuned okay we're gonna first i guess start off right on top and we have this brand new tag still holiday what is this a tea towel maybe Oh, it's cute. It's a little Santa um, towel, hand towel. So he's kind of cute. Colors are kind of country. Uh, I guess this was from Barth and Dreyfus of California. Never heard of it. it was two ninety nine originally. It's cute, it has like that country cottage like feel to it. So I think I am going to uh, pass this on and put it in my eBay store. Let me move some of this stuff over. Next up, let's see. Looks like a handmade ornament. Let's see, it's a little dark in here. Let's see if I can get the light to work a little bit better guys can see better. Here's this homemade, looks like a gingerbread guy. It's made out of wood. It's kind of cute. I think I'm going to keep him and add him to my tree. There's somebody's homemade ornament. Another wooden ornament. It's kind of cool. It's this little Santa Claus guy. And I think he will go with the towel guy over there. I'm going to reset him. Doesn't really fancy my taste. Oh, here's someone's very <laughs> Christmas homemade ornament with Santa Claus. And this little guy here. I may take out that photo and put in another photo, but this is kind of cute. I do like this, it's out of, uh, made out of plastic. So, I may keep that guy. Oh, this is cute. This is Noah and Friends. It's a little Noah's Ark Christmas ornament with the two giraffes and the two elephants. That's cute. Also made out of wood. And there's a year on here. This is 1996. Handmade in 96. Kind of cute. That's a maybe. I might keep that one. I don't know. My kids would like. Maybe like that one. Or, oh. This guy looks like a drummer boy. Or a drummer guy. Drummer man. No year on it. But... It does have a tag here. Let's see what it says. 12 Days of Christmas from Midwest of Canyon Falls. I think they also sell those. Do they sell ornaments and stuff? I've heard of this company. I don't remember if they sell those little cute mice. Like mice ornaments. That Canyon Falls sounds familiar. I think I've, I either have or have sold some ornaments from that same company. And it just has a 12 days of Christmas here. This is cute. I might may keep him, not too sure. This one fell out of its tissue paper. Bless us everyone. This looks like 
what does that say? Boyd's maybe? I can't read that. Oh yeah, 1997, the Boyd's collection. So I don't collect Boyd's bears, but I know a lot of people do. So this is going to go in a sale lot along with those things. Let's see what else do we got here. Oh, I'm not... I'm not a collector of snowmen, guys. Well, never really like snowmen, but he is holding that cute little cardinal. Look at that. Adorable. I'm not keeping him. He will be for sale, but look at this guy. He's cute. Kind of heavy. Made out of wood, I think. His beanie's covering his coal eyes. And he will be up for sale in a lot. Oh, this one fell out of its thingy also it's tissue paper this does have something on the bottom ggi don't know what that means but it's this cute little what is that a squirrel yeah squirrel with the santa hat inside his walnut sled so cute he's a maybe He fell out too. Here's another little handmade gingerbread. I probably will keep him. He's made out of fabric and stuffed probably with polyfill. Here's another snowman. He kind of looks like the snowman. He's reminding me of the snowman from that movie. He probably isn't. Uh, it's not marked. This is like a ceramic. Uh, not keeping him because, like I said, I don't collect snowmen. Not a fan of snowmen. Mm, let's see what else is in here. Move this tissue paper. Okay, we've got. This is fun. Oh, it's another snowman. It's a star snowman. He looks homemade too. Out of, I don't know, something. Sand? He looks like he's made out of sand. He's kind of got that grittiness to him. And then he has a painted Christmas sweater on. And why are you wearing a Halloween hat? Anyhow, he will be for sale to next. We have so many. This whole box is filled, guys, with Christmas ornaments. So, let's see. These guys are kind of cute. I'm not really into bears or collecting bears. This guy's kind of heavy. Oh, the stocking's cute. He has a little tag on him. Let's see if it says anything. Oh no, it looks like he was holding on maybe to something that broke off. Maybe another little bear. That broken piece is like the a hand it looks like. So it is busted. Maybe I can just pull this off and it could be, you know, just these two guys. Oh, they lost their baby bear. Anyhow, it's a cute little ornament. And it is by, oh, it's made in China. This is a, this is a for sale. This is going in a lot. Not really into the, the bears. Okay, up next. Oh, something feels broken in this. Oh, no, not broken, just miniatures. Oh, adorable, guys. This one's so cute. It's, it looks like Cat in the Hat. Oh, look it. That is so cute. Yeah, it's made in China, but I'll forgive that because he is a cutie. That's Cat in the Hat, right? It looks like Cat in the Hat. Is that Cat in the Hat? Yeah, I don't know. His color's off. Wasn't he a darker color? I don't know. Let me know in the comments if this is Cat in the Hat. Look, sure looks like him. Okay, this is a keep. I like this little guy. Oh, here, look. He looks like he was the busted bear. Maybe I can fix that with some E6000. He was the, the little busted bear from... Okay, let me switch hands here. The little busted bear that lost his parents. Look. I think I'll 
try to glue that back on, guys. And he will be included in the lot with his mommy and daddy. Here's another little bear ornament carrying these jingle bells and a little peppermint candy and a candy cane. This is cute. He's in his PJs or she. What is that? A little heart maybe? Says it is from... Gosh, I can't read that, guys. Uh, KSA Inc. So that's going to be for sale in a lot. Oh, and here's some more bear ornaments. <laughs> Guess this person, whoever got rid of their ornaments, was into bears. So here's another one. That's cute. That is really cute. This one's a bigger one. Um, and they're holding on to a little candy cane. This one's made in China and also from KSA Inc. So it's this is like made out of a, I don't know, resin maybe or some type of composite something. This would be for sale along with these other guys. It's a cute little bear collection. Let's see what else we got here. Let's open up this one. Oh, more bears. More bears, guys. And this one says... Oh, it's bears in the form of a Christmas tree with Merry Christmas on it. Um, this one says... What does that say? Focus. Is it the same company? Uh, different company, but also made in China. This is cute, but just not into the bears, guys. Look at that. That is a whole lot of Christmas bears right there. Next. Oh, a snowman. He's cute. This, this, would, this snowman I would consider keeping. He's a cutie. He's fallen on his snow butt, and he has no markings. But he's cute. This one's cute. Oh wait, there's a mark in there. What does that say? <laughs> GGI, like the other one. This one's cute. This is a maybe. I don't know. I said I don't like snowmen, but my kids might like this guy. Okay. Oh my goodness sakes. It's another bear. He is a bear. He's a Boyd's bear. He is a hanging ornament, and let's see if he has a year on him, 1990 to 1997, Boyd's Bear Company, yep, he was a Christmas Boyd's Bear, he will be for sale, let's see, um, anyways, I was saying this box is already worth, uh, the $4.99 I paid for it, I think, this is a lot of ornaments. Here's just this little gift box. I might send this over to Lucid. I know she likes um, butterflies, and this is a pretty one. Pretty little box ornament. Maybe handmade, I don't know. But it's cute. She'll like that, I think. I'm going to send that to her, Elizabeth, over at Lucid Curios channel. There's still all of that left in here. So we're about halfway down the box. Wow, more bears in stockings. This is a cute one. And they've got these little snowballs or cotton balls hanging off. Cute. That's homemade. He looks like um, Santa Claus in his PJs. In his country PJs. Kind of cute. Mm, don't know about the colors. He's a maybe. I think someone made this because there's no tags on him. He looks like he has wooden peg feet and hands sewn into his pajamas. And two little tiny eyes. He's cute. Um, I don't think I'll keep him. I think I'll put him for sale with that first table. Um, 
cloth or that towel that we first took out. Okay, one more. One more since he was kind of disappointed. I'm going to reach into this and grab this one. What are you? Um, I'm gonna take a wild guess and say this is Texas University Longhorns ornament. And I am not a native Texan, so I'm not gonna keep that. Or should I keep it? Since I live in Texas now, I should assimilate. I don't know. He doesn't go with any of my Christmas decor. <laughs> Okay, one more, one more, one more. He was kind of disappointing too. Oh my goodness, enough with the bears. Mmm, bear wreath. With the heart. And some jingle bells. And some holly. And one more, one more, one more. Come on, be a good one. Be a good one. Uh, another bear. Oh my gosh. <laughs> He's a little bear in a wreath. <laughs> He's kind of cute. He's holding on. Look at that. Cute. So I think all these bear guys I'm going to put in one Christmas lot. And they are all going to be for sale. Because that is a whole lot of bears. Kind of disappointed. Stay tuned for part two when I get to it, hopefully it's sometime this week. Let me know what your favorite ornament is. If you guys are into the gingerbread guys, the bear ornaments, or snowmen, or Santa. I'm, I really tend to like like Santa Claus's him not so much but yeah these are some pretty cute ornaments um I'm not gonna probably keep any of these other than maybe this guy and him and those two gingerbread guys and maybe that wreath everything else I think I'm gonna lot up and put up for sale so Anyhow, hope you guys enjoyed this quick video and stay tuned for part two and see what is inside the rest of this Christmas ornament cat box here. Anyhow, see you later, bye guys.